This week's Parsha lesson is dedicated to Frajda Bas Avraham and to Rashi Bas Chayameir. In the beginning of the Parsha, it says, Command Aaron and his son, saying, This is the law of the burnt offering. Rashi writes that the term tzav denotes encouragement for the present and future generations. And Rabbi Shimon said that it is especially necessary to give encouragement in the places where there is a chisaron kis, a loss of money. Chisaron kis literally means loss of purse. Why does the text not say chisaron mamon, loss of money? Hasidus explains, the burnt offering atones for sinful thoughts. A person can also sin with his eyes by viewing improper things, with his ears by hearing evil, and with his tongue by speaking sinfully. To avoid speaking, the upper and lower jaw are like a kis, a purse, that can lock up the tongue. The eyelids are a kis that can cover the eyes and prevent them from seeing not good things. And the external parts of the ears can be a kis, which can seal them from hearing not good things. The only part of the body that's not protected is the mind. Therefore, Rabbi Shimon says that it is necessary to warn a person to be especially careful with their thoughts because of chisaron kis, the absence of an external constraint. It took me about 15 to 20 times to make the dedication in the beginning.